Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. In this video, we will see how to escape the meta characters in a regular expression string. For example, if we have a word and if we want to write the regular expression for that one, and we are having a some meta characters in that word, and you want to take the literal value of that meta characters, <clears throat> then what you will do? So we cannot use this one directly meta characters, right? For example, we have seen one of the meta character that is nothing but a dot of dot meta character. We can also call it as a period of meta character also. So when we use this period meta character, what does this period meta character will do? That means nothing but dot. So if we try to see about this regex span, so let's try to open this one regexpal.com. So what does this one will do? For example, so this would be the final word okay we are having a string something like this and i want to match anything something like dot d with a dot <clears throat> so now what is the thing it is trying to see so d followed by any character so this dot has a special meaning in the regular expression that is nothing but it matches any character so this one dot is called as a meta character so like this we have so many meta characters if you try to see here so we are having dollar dot star plus question mark is equal to exclamatory column so like this we have so many meta characters and if you want to get the literal value of this meta character to find that one in the word or to find that one in a sentence means what we need to do so for example let's say that here we are having a regular expression and here so if when you are trying to use this d with a dot now here it is matching two phrases so two sentences two words it is matching so that is nothing but d followed by a space and also d followed by a dot operator but here we are having a d followed by a dot operator dot dot character and also d followed by space here the regular expression d follow d with a dot means dot means any character but here what i want is i should not it should not match this d followed by space it should match only d with a literal value of this dot so that is nothing but full stop so here if you want to match only this d followed by dot means so how can we write the regular expression for this one so for this type of scenarios now we know that dot represents a meta character that means matches any character but here we don't have a special meaning for that we need to match the exact character that is nothing but a dot so how can we match this one is we have a special type that is nothing but an escaping the meta character we can also escape the meta character now here this dot represents a meta character and we can escape this meta character and tell the regular expression engine that take only the literal value of that character literal value as the character not do not take it as a meta character so for this one what we need to do is we need to add a forward slash <coughs> at the uh, at the preceding of this meta character now if you try to see the forward slash followed by a dot means so whatever the character it is there after the forward slash it will it will take only the literal value it will not take it as a meta character it will take only the literal value now here instead of matching d with a space it is matching only with a d with a dot why because here we have a forward slash in front of this dot so because of that reason so it is taking only the literal value now you need to understand that you need to understand another thing that when can i use this met escaping this meta character when can i use this forward slash so what type of characters i can use it so we can use for all type of meta characters and also we in the cheat sheet if you open you'll be able to see for the w so you'll be having forward slash so that it has a specific meaning for that one so like this you'll be having slash b word boundary and slash dot we have seen that escaping the special characters those are nothing but the meta characters so like this we will be using special uh, slash like this forward slash for those results for example let's say that i am having at the rate here now if i use at the rate with preceding with a forward slash means then what it will happen so now we know that at the rate does not have any meaning in the regular expression engine now if you use forward slash before this at the rate means so we are telling nothing but we are telling to the regular expression engine that any any character that is after the forward slash take the literal value for that one so now at the rate follow uh, forward slash and followed by an at the rate means it will take only the literal value of at the rate now here it will match 
only d with an at the rate so this is the meaning of this one now if you use any character if you use any character before that one if you use any forward slash for that one so it will it will take the literal character so literal literal value of that one for example if you use the dot it will take the literal value of the dot then it will match only the dot now if you take the set the rate means it will match only the at the rate so like that it will happen now let's say that we are having a forward slash here okay so we are having a sorry forward slash here now how can i get this d followed by a forward slash how can i write a regular expression for this one so for that one also you can use something like forward slash followed by forward slash now what you are trying to tell is so whatever the things so preceding this forward slash take the literal value so that is nothing but then forward slash for this one so literal value taking so it will it will take only the d with the forward slash so this is how we will be uh we will be escaping the meta characters using this forward slash so like this if you try to use forward slash this one each one has a special meaning for that one so now if you use this forward slash with the forward slash means it will search for the forward slash uh, character d followed by a forward slash and if you use any value that doesn't have any meaning for that one means it will take the literal value of that one and if you use any meta character for this one so it will convert that uh, it will convert that meta character to a normal uh, character so this is how we will be using for escaping the meta characters hope you understood about this escaping of the meta characters if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you